for what is it like for women not only to be readers in a society that tells us that the, humans can, the human story, um, it looks like this, but anything that we write is a chick story or anything that a person of, of, of color writes is a political story. Like what does that do to our ability to actually have a voice? So here's a couple of quotes that I found very moving. The first one is, the first two are from Sylvia Plath. Um, I am not, this, these are from her diary. So this, like, the writing's not very like, uh, developed, she's just writing her diary. I am not content because my law is limited. The very content of finding yourself is overshadowed by admitting you are not only grotesque, but a special kind of grotesque. Frustrated, yes, why? Because it is impossible for me to be God or, any, or the universal man, woman, anything. She's writing about why she can't write. And that line, I can't be God. That really struck me. She's like, she, she's cognizant of it. She's like, I can't achieve voice. Think about how many women right now are writing memoirs instead of novels. Because we don't think that we can tell the story of the generation. We can only refer to ourselves. She also wrote, um, another thing, must stop my concern with my position in the world. Another phantom I am. That line right there it blows my mind. Another phantom I am. She has a split consciousness. She's writing to an, an audience in her head, and she can't achieve the God voice to write a novel. Even when she did, it's very close to just being autobiographical. And then Audre Lorde, this one is very crushing, actually. She's responding to actually to James Baldwin in dialogue about their different experiences as writers. And she says, deep, deep down, I know that dream was never mine. Because he says, Baldwin's like, we all actually want the American dream. He says, I know that dream was never mine. And I wept and I cried and I fought and I stormed, but I just knew it. I was black. I was female. I was out. Out by any construct, wherever the power lay. So I had to claw myself insane. If I lived, I was going to have to do it alone. Nobody was dreaming about me. Nobody was even studying me except as something to wipe out. Even worse than the nightmare is the blank. A black woman are the blank. 